Thank you for viewing our presentation on the arts at Franklin Pierce University. There are many ways to experience the arts on our campus, including taking courses in the fine arts, in dance, in theater, and music courses through the music department, including private instruction. You can also view exhibitions at the Throw Art Gallery of national and regional artists and of student work. You can also catch performances through the various ensembles in the music department, theater performances through the dance club, and the winter dance concert put on by the dance classes. There are three full-time professors at Franklin Pierce University. Professor Lou Bunk oversees the music department and teaches music composition, theory, and technology. Professor Susan Silverman teaches ceramics, printmaking, East Asian brush painting, and book arts. Myself, Nathan Sullivan, teaches painting and drawing. I also teach 2D design. We have numerous other professionals that teach in our areas and fill out our course offerings in music, fine arts, and in theater and dance. These professionals teach as lecturers and instructors. They work within their fields, both regionally and nationally, exhibiting their work or, or giving performances. We have numerous art courses on campus, and they are available to all students, regardless of whether they're majoring and minoring in an area. We have private music instruction. We have music ensembles that are open to all students. We have theater and dance productions put on by the, art, the clubs. Visual art courses in painting, photography, East Asian brush painting, glass bowing, graphic design, and printmaking. Music courses include retorting techniques, music and film, history of electronic music. Many of these courses fulfill your general education requirement towards graduation. We have a guest artist and music series. These artists and musicians come to campus to put on performances, give lectures, and demonstrations of their working methods. We have an art club and a music club, both making use of the facilities on campus and taking trips off of campus to view performances and exhibitions. The Throw Art Gallery exhibits both student and professional work, bringing artists to our campus to share their work with the community. And the music department puts on concerts through their ensembles and senior recitals. The music department has three concentrations, professional, performance, and technology track. My colleague, Professor Lou Bunk, will speak in more detail about the music department. Hi, my name is Lou Bunk, and I am a professor of music at Franklin Pierce University. Uh, I have a PhD in music composition, music theory from Brandeis University. Um, and my main area of research is in music composition, experimental music composition and computer music composition. Um, our music program here at Franklin Pierce uh, serves the entire uh, student uh, population. Uh, we have many classes that anyone can take um, that, and some most do fulfill. Uh, the gen ed requirements um, in arts and design. Uh, we have recording techniques, we have jazz history, film and music, um, uh, and a few other courses like that, that, um, that will uh, um, pique a lot of students' interest. Uh, our facilities are available to anyone taking classes um, or having, have taken classes uh, in our department. And, you know, sometimes students come up to me and haven't taken a class and want to practice on a piano, and that's fine too. Um, but we have uh, four practice rooms with pianos. We have a fifth one uh, with a uh, drum set and percussion studio. We have a computer music studio that is uh, a computer lab uh, with music software on the computers. We have a recording studio classroom where I teach recording techniques um, and students have access to work in there um, um, after hours, uh, again, 24 seven access. Here's a, a picture of our classroom. Um, and, uh, yeah, students work in here all the time on curricular work, um, extracurricular work. Um, I think as of right now, there's three 
um, extracurricular ensembles that are completely student run. Um, one's a, a rock band, another is a folk duo, and a third is a, um, a, a pretty heavy, uh, like 70s style rock band. Um, uh, but they have access 24 seven. Uh, we have a major in music, uh, which has three concentrations, uh, professional performance and music technology. Uh, our professional track is the smallest of the three, being 43 credits, and is, is the one that usually students will double major in something else with. Um, so some common ones are double majoring in music and communication or music and business. Music and psychology has been done. Music in English is um, fairly popular, uh, a, a, as well as music and education. Um, we've had a couple of students recently who will double major uh, in music and fulfilling the, the K through five or K through eight uh, primary education major. One of our big strengths is, uh, is, is the fact that we are a small liberal arts college. We, um, the music department is small but mighty. Our students all know each other. They collaborate together. They get a well. They've formed a really nice community of uh, musicians um, here at Franklin Pierce. Um, our classes are small. My recording class has 13 students. My history of electronic music class has 15 students in it. Um, and even the bigger classes are not that big, 20-ish um, for most classes on, on campus. Um, so you get a lot of contact with uh, your faculty. Um, I know all my majors, all my minors. Uh, one thing that I tell students about taking music classes or minoring or even majoring in music is the um, the soft skills that you develop. Um, obviously, you learn how to be a musician and those are all um, those skills. But there's a lot of soft skills that a, that a lot of employers will value, like teamwork and discipline and creativity and concentration, openness to feedback. These are all things that musicians have um, and employers are looking for. If you want to study privately on a particular instrument, we have uh, just about any instrument you can imagine, um, and you you can you get twelve lessons a semester on that. And here's a picture of our ensembles. We have a jazz ensemble, a percussion ensemble, a rock band, a vocal ensemble, a guitar ensemble, a brass ensemble. We have a pep band as well, and and these are all great ways to get involved in, in music at Franklin Pierce, and anyone can play in these ensembles. At Franklin Pierce, we offer classes in theater and dance. We have a dedicated large black box theater and well-lit dance studio. Classes in theater focus on introductory acting and production courses. And classes in dance are in dance movement. Dance courses put on a winter dance concert in the fall semester. And the theater club makes use of the black box theater to put on their own productions. Some examples of dance courses and theater productions. The Visual Arts Department offers courses in numerous areas, including photography, glass blowing, painting, drawing, printmaking. Our photography courses include both film and digital. We still have wet dark rooms with for sil silver gelatin prints. Visual Arts Department classes are quite small. Most studio courses are 8 to 15 students, and our art history and foundations of art courses cap out at 20. Our various studios for the different classes are open 24 7 to students taking those courses, allowing them to use equipment and continue with their projects outside of class time. We offer a visual arts minor. At Franklin Pierce. The visual arts minor is a minimum of six courses. The visual arts minor requires students to take either art history or foundations of art, drawing one, 2D or 3D design, and a level one and level two in one of the concentration areas of glass bowing, photography, printmaking, drawing, or painting. Additionally, students may take up to level four in one of those concentration areas. Our glass blowing shed 
is a favorite on campus. Glass blowing classes are quite small, capping out at eight. We have faculty that come from all over to teach our glass blowing department. Our painting area focuses on oil and acrylics in their introductory courses. Advanced students take, have instruction in egg tempera, fresco, and encaustic techniques. We work from, with the both life abstraction and conceptual approaches. And painting courses take, use of, take advantage of the beauty of the campus to get out and work from the landscape and surrounding area. Our dedicated drawing studio has many props and intro courses focus on working from life. Our sculpture class works with mixed media, clay, and wood. Our printmaking course has a dedicated studio. The printmaking course works with monotype, woodcut, and other relief processes and intaglio processes focusing on non-toxic printmaking approaches to etching and photo printmaking. The graphic design area makes use of our digital up-to-date Mac Lab. The Thoreau Art Gallery is centrally located in campus in Peterson Manor. The gallery hosts five to six exhibitions a year, bringing regional and national artists to our campus for solo or group exhibitions. In addition, the gallery hosts a summer exhibition of student works from selected by faculty from their courses throughout the year. Some recent exhibitions have included Janice by Rob Dirks and The In-Betweens by Elaine Petova, professor at UMass Dartmouth. Often through our visiting artist series, gallery artists will give talks about their works to various groups of students and faculty and the rest of the FPU community. Also as part of our visiting artist series, artists will often demonstrate their technical and conceptual approaches to their art making processes to students and the rest of the FPU community. Thank you for taking the time to listen to our presentation. If you have any questions, you can contact any of the faculty in the Fine Arts or Music Department.